compensated for what they do on a daily basis. They've been without a friggin' contract and getting any real money for 10 years. They've been I, what, what they offered them was an insult because they're paying again and again and again. When is their time that they're actually going to get something? Chief Executive Officer Robert Milton went away with $100 million. Where's their money? You know, guy called Brewer, $17 million. Where's their money? You know, they'd like to be able to send their kids to hockey and their daughters to ballet. They'd like to resume that. Milton sending his kids to private schools in England. Where's their money? That's all they're asking. So this is a delaying tactic, that's all it's doing. And you know what it's done? It's taking the pressure off the company to come to the table and get us a fair deal. These people all want a fair deal and they want it now. How long will you be out here today? Well, I'm going to be here for an hour or so anyway. Yeah, I just want to say to the Canadian public, come out and support us. We want a fair deal for these people and we want it now. Okay, brothers and sisters. First of all, this is a fabulous rally. Yeah! And if this ain't gonna send Air Canada and the government of, of, of the day a message that you're as mad as hell and you're not gonna take it anymore. Your union today launched an appeal in order to challenge Lisa Riggs' right. <laughs> Secondly, we had some idiot this morning whose name is Limit on CTV, an anti labor lawyer who said, and I'm quoting this, they may have a secret deal. I'm getting 
making millions. When is your turn? coming out and moreover I want to thank you for your support of your bargaining committee to get back there and face to face to say to this corporation <laughs>